case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Joseph had sought to challenge certain conclusions of law, arguing that lesser sanctions would be more adequate in compelling him to comply with future orders of the court. He also disputed the belief that his actions had caused significant harm to Mary that merited the court's severe sanctions. Yet the appellate court was unconvinced by his challenges and found that the trial court's conclusions were considerably supported by various factors of the case. Prominently, its stance was bolstered by findings of fact 17, 18, 23, 29, 30, and 32. The case culminated with the appellate court upholding the trial court's original sanction of entering a default judgment against Joseph on the issues of post-separation support and permanent alimony. This potentially precedent-setting ruling served to emphasize the crucial importance of respecting court orders. The case was heard by a panel of judges, with Judges Wynne and Steelman both concurring with the verdict. The ruling demonstrated that the lower court appropriately handled the case, further reaffirming the principle that disobeying court orders carries significant consequences. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.